Hey, how's it going? Welcome to a new workout. I got an awesome workout plan for you today. Today is day number five of your beginner boot camp. We have upper body day today, and we're gonna get after it. We have seven minutes, 30 seconds. Have a wonderful workout. Tell yourself something super positive, and let's get after it together. All right, here we go. Feet are gonna be shoulder width apart. We're gonna have those arms coming straight out. We're gonna punch back and forth. I want you to punch towards that center line, though, okay? So we're just gonna go back and forth with those arms. Have your arms come right by your sides, all right? So right into that center line and keep that jab right up at chest level. Good. Back and forth. You got 19 seconds to go. Moving those arms back and forth. Good. If you're blading a little bit on this bottom side, that's okay. You're going to feel the core pull a little bit. And then when you blade on this side a little bit, you're going to feel the core pull a little bit each time. Two. One, you're down. We're going to come to the floor, all right? We're going to come to the floor just like we're in the pool, <laughs> but we're not. All right, we're going to have those arms come straight out. We're going to lift them off the floor. We're going to come right in behind. We're going to try to touch the small of our backs. Coming right back out. Good. Keeping those legs on the floor for me, all right? Bringing up right in behind. Good. For whatever reason, if you need a break, you can just take your hands and we'll just put them on the floor. All right, take that second, come and get back up. Good, bring it right in behind. Good, we got seven seconds to go. You got seven seconds to go. We're gonna punch again in three, two, one, you're up. Awesome job, coming right back to the top. All right, we got a few seconds to go. We're gonna come right back here. Feet shoulder width apart, punch towards that center line. Okay, good. Here we go, punching. Keeping those arms, scraping the sides each time. Good, 22 seconds. Keeping the core on though. Keep the core on through that punch. Don't let it go. Punch toward that center line. Keeping those arms moving at a decent pace, good. You got 10 seconds, 10 seconds, and then we're gonna go right to the floor. In three, two, one, awesome job. Come back down to the floor. If you're starting to breathe heavy from the punching, so am I, all right, coming right down. We're gonna come straight up, okay? Coming straight up, hands come out, all the way to the top, coming right in. Good, all the way back. Good, really reach, bringing it right up, all the way. If you're finding that shoulder mobility gets stuck right about here, get as far as you can, okay? And then come right back up, okay? If you get stuck anywhere, just come as far as you can, all right? Try to touch if you can, coming right back up. All right, all right we're gonna come straight up. All right, we're gonna come straight up. Okay, here we go. We're going to start with some arm circles. We're going to be right out, feet are going to be shoulder width. We're just going to start moving those arms forwards, all right? Keeping them right up, keeping the circles kind of tight here, all right? Keep the circles kind of tight. 20 seconds, don't lose the core. Turn the core on, turn the abs on. Good. Keep working for it. Shoulders will feel it start to burn a little bit especially after we just did that last exercise. Come on, keep them up, keep them up. You got five seconds. Good, four, three, two, you're down. Awesome job, coming right to the floor. We're gonna come straight down. We're gonna get some triceps right now. What I'm gonna ask you to do is take that right foot and put it over that left knee, okay? We're gonna come straight down, all right? Fingers are pointing behind you. You're gonna come straight up, all right? Come straight down, straight up, and straight down. Good, all the way up, nice. All the way down, just right on your butt. You're gonna come straight up as high as you can. Good, coming straight back down, straight up. Good, breathe for me, back down. We're gonna switch legs here in a second. We're gonna come right back up to the top. Good, coming straight back down. We're gonna come right up, all right? We're gonna get those arm circles again, all right? We've done six rounds, I think. I think we've done six rounds. Here we go, coming right 
up, right up, keep it nice and tight. This time we're gonna go the other way, go the other way for me. So if we did forwards the last time, we're gonna do backwards, okay? Keep it nice and tight again, turn the core on. If your legs are too close together here or inside shoulder width, you might forget about your core. So I just want you to step it out and get shoulder width for me. It makes you turn it on a little bit more. Here we go, in four, three, two, we're down, awesome job, shake that out. We're just gonna go to the other side. Fingers in behind, facing away. You're gonna take that opposite leg that you just were working with. We're gonna come straight up. Here we go, all the way up, good. Bring it all the way back down, up, up, good. If you find that you're too long here, you can always bring your foot in a little bit and come right up. You got 17 seconds to go, 17 seconds to go. Back up and down, here we go. Squeeze it out, try to lock it out at the top, okay? Coming right back down, good. You got five seconds to go. Three, two, there you go. Here we go, coming right up. All right, we're gonna do Coming right back on the floor in just a second. We're gonna come straight down. We're gonna hinge at the hips for me, okay? You're gonna come straight up. You're gonna draw the shoulder blades together and you're gonna kick the arms out, all right? Bring the arms back in, drop it all the way down. Keep your elbows slightly bent here. Draw the shoulder blades together, squeeze. Shoot the arms out, all right? Bring it right back down, good. It's pretty slow here, the movement. Contract those shoulder blades together. Bring it right out, good, back down. Last two exercises, they're gonna be for our abs, okay? We're gonna do them standing today. You're gonna have your arms right by your ears. You're gonna come up, you're gonna cross that leg, just the left side, and bring it right up. And try to turn the torso, okay? So we're gonna try to look to that left side, that left wall. All right, come up, turn the head or the torso so your head is looking at the wall, okay? Be nice and tall through here, all right? Elbows coming right back, don't have them forward, have them right back. Come up, turn, bring it right back down. Come up, turn, bring it right back down. All right, we're gonna go to that other side. This is your last exercise, all right? This one's pretty tough. I get it, for the balance, pick a spot if you can, all right, when you're coming up, all right, so we're gonna just turn, coming straight up, other side, turn, bring it right back down. When you turn, turn that torso, coming right up. One side might be harder than the other to get it right up, make sure that those elbows are back. Good. Right back up, feet shoulder width apart here, okay? Coming up, turn, back down, good. You got five seconds, give me one more. Good, you're down. Awesome job, let me stop this. I must have screwed up my math again. But awesome job, all right? Way to work for it, way to start a new habit. Way to believe in yourself a little bit and take that time for yourself. It's so important that you do. And it's in the first steps of moving forward to spending time with yourself and caring for yourself and loving yourself. It's really important, um, especially with everything that we have going on. So week number two, series number two, I wanna to talk to you just for a second about it. We're gonna work with the band and the, or the pink thing and the core band. And that's it next week. We're gonna do some of the same exercises again, but you're gonna start feeling this a little bit differently by using the equipment, okay? Using a band, using the core band. You'll notice it makes a pretty big difference on doing some of these exercises, and we're still just gonna be using your body, all right? We'll I'll have some new exercises for you next week. And uh, thanks so much for training with me and, and, and trusting me, um, you know, to start your fitness journey. Uh, it's, it's appreciated. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Um, usually around, <laughs> try to take a little bit of time off on the weekend, but uh, yeah, if you need anything, let me know. All right, thanks so much again. 
We'll see you for series two, high five from the heart.